Oh well, I guess the intro is not going to play. It's stuck. Whatever. It doesn't matter. We'll just get into it. Uh, what's up, savages? Thanks for tuning in to the show. Uh, tonight is Wednesday, May 15th, 2019. I believe that's right. It is Wednesday, right? Yeah. Uh, thanks so much for everyone liking, subscribing, watching, and all that stuff. You guys are awesome. I really appreciate it. We are back for another show, but first let's take a quick look at the market. I already have it up here. Let's do a quick refresh because this is crazy. I think the best way to describe it is like this. I don't think desktop audio is working either, but whatever. It's bananas. That's what I mean. All right, guys. So, um, yeah. Market's going crazy still, so that's good. Uh, ETH is just killing it. They've, they're have they up 20% in the last 24 hours, but I mean, I think they started yesterday morning at 250, or I'm sorry, 200 or 202 or something like that. Um, so they've, they've made a huge uh, jump there. And BTC, I, I wanna say just about an hour ago, it was like at 8,000, I believe. I don't know. I could be messing all this up, but I, it, my, everything's kind of blurry right now because it's like I can't believe you know the. It's just crazy. Anyway, all right. <laughs> uh, let's see here. What we got going on um, tonight? What I wanted to cover was actually the swap pool, the micro pool, and um, they just recently did an update. I think it was today, actually. Let me see, and I, I wanted to do this like completely live. I'm already uh, mining on the swap micro pool. Uh, here it is right here. And you can see that I have actually hit 13 blocks since last night. Each block is like 3.5 or 3.4 or something like that right now. Um, so I hit that uh, since yesterday evening, last night. So, um, yeah, still doing pretty good. I'm averaging with this little six card rig, getting 30 GPS. I'm averaging about 15 to 18 a day. So that's not terrible. Um, but anyway, so they have up, upgraded this. Um, that's the swap daemon right there. Uh, so what I'll do is, um, I haven't prepped at all. So this is all gonna be live. So I'm gonna do this just like I was doing it if I wasn't live streaming. So I'm probably gonna turn this off or shut this down. I'm also gonna shut down, uh, actually this I could probably just leave running. This is the daemon, the swap D. So I'll leave that up and running. Then I'm gonna go to their website and go to, uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. let's see here, not miners, uh, pools. And then the micro pool and the latest release right here. And yep, yeah, okay, so 22 hours ago, and this is micro pool 1.4.0. So let's go ahead and download that. I'm running it on Windows. I'm gonna do the uh, setup, not the portable. I'll just do the full setup. See if we can get that going. Not really checking the chat just yet. Let me uh, let me get some things going here real quick. So it looks like it's done. So then we'll right click on it and choose run as administrator. So it looks like, see these guys are awesome. Okay, so apparently it grabbed, because it was the installed version, I'm assuming that because it's the installed version, uh, it used the settings from the previous version. Because I didn't have to do anything. <laughs> All I did was ran it. 
installed it and ran it and boom here it is all right so you've got the one worker on here that's great it's already uh, hashing away it, well it's already has GPS value now this wasn't working in the previous version uh, of the micro pool now it is so that's good you can see your GPS on here um, what else we got here Do -do -do -do. yeah it even it's using my correct address and everything all right great so it looks like there's a log that's what we're looking at here with what's going on and even down here you can see the um, you know the GPS but it's nice to see it up here this is probably maybe some type of average or maybe the last entry yeah it looks like it's the last entry there uh, so this is you know building as it's going right and then you also have a workers tab so I'm assuming that if you had more than one worker it would just show up in here as another you know as another li uh, listed worker in here and then show you your hash rate for each one so that is cool because I I would imagine that what will happen here is if you had two workers or three workers or four workers then your GPS would just be increased and you wouldn't know uh, each individual workers particular GPS right so in order to break it out and know which worker is doing what they have the workers tab now which is nice so you can quickly you know click on the worker tab and see all the workers I only have one so you know it's kind of pointless to uh, go to the workers tab but um, you know whenever I get things back up and running here after I get my power squared away and all that stuff I will be having I will have more rigs on uh, swap most likely so that is a nice feature that's awesome and then blocks also I would assume that if we hit a block before the end of the show here that it's going to show up here and probably have lots of information about the block itself um, maybe maybe even what the reward is I don't know um, let's see if uh, Seb is actually in here hey what's up I dig big blocks Pete so there's only one person watching and it's you that's weird but it's also I kind of expected that because everyone is glued to the market right everyone's probably got coin 360 up right now and they're probably just uh you know refreshing it like this just like i am <laughs> just over and over and over and just like ah you know this is the greatest time ever you know it's happening it's happening you know all that stuff so um man i you know i keep thinking because i i got a little bit more uh, ETH today. I know I was late on that show. I probably should have probably should have got more at, you know, a little a little cheaper. But anyway, um, I don't want I hope that this isn't like the euphoria stuff, right? I, I hope that I, from what I can see, what from what I'm reading and everything and I'm um, just keeping my eye on everything. This is a it's got a lot of momentum behind it. I don't really see things changing too much too quickly. But this is not financial advice. I'm just talking. I'm just an idiot on the internet, right? Uh, but just from what I can tell, it just seems like things are going... It, there's a lot of momentum to just keep going in this direction. I'll say that. Uh, so that is good uh, for us crypto folks. So yeah, my um, my intro, my Cobus intro was broke for some reason. It was hung up, and it still hung. I would probably have to close down. Um, I might be able to. Let me let me see if I can switch off of. Let me go over here. intro to play here there we go we got it nice drums in there by Cobus so that is uh, super cool all right um, I you know honestly that's it. I mean, we, we already did the whole, they, 
these guys are awesome. You know, the swap guys, Seb Green and those guys. I can't, I can't say enough good stuff about them. Uh, I mean, they really are looking out for making things super easy because you saw how easy that was. I didn't even I didn't uninstall the other one. I didn't go into I didn't have to go into any config files. I didn't have to do anything. I just reinstalled this one or installed the new version and uh it just picked up my old settings and everything and off and running. So that is uh super awesome. The previous version did not have any of these tabs down here at all. It just had the log and that was it. Super cool. I don't know. I think that's going to be it for me. Maybe the shortest live stream I've ever done with my machine not crashing anyway. <laughs> I've done some shorter ones that where my machine crashed, but um, I don't know. You guys got anything you want to talk about or want me to look up? I could let's let's check out some a few coins on uh, Coin Market Cap real quick. Some of our favorite ones that we always do. Let's go. I, there's one in particular. I gotta. Uh, I, I want to see too. So Aeon is doing really well. That's awesome. Glad to see that. Um, their all-time high was ten dollars and forty something cents, I believe. So ten fifty-one looks like. So let's get there. It would be really nice. I don't know. I don't know if we've got that much momentum, but that would be awesome. Um, this is the highest I've been in quite a while, though. So that is that is nice to see. Let's look at Zell. I don't think that Zell was doing great today. Yeah, 5%. Not bad. But they were recently, just within the past month or so, they were up to 20-something cents. So they, they have dropped quite a bit. Yeah, like right here, they hit... Was it just 10 cents? I thought it was more than that. Yeah, here we go. So right here, they were at uh, 22, you know, just recently. So... Um, you know they're chugging along not not too bad I think if more people knew about them that uh, you know things would change for them pretty quickly um, just get the word out I guess on them it's great great project great group of folks over there I like them let's check out Raven check this guys check this out 31% and I think it was actually more than that earlier because I want to say that they were touching uh, like 7.075 uh, 7 cents, I believe is what they actually went up to. Maybe not. I was looking at Blockfolio and Blockfolio had them at like 7 something. But Blockfolio is a, uh, Blockfolio is a little wonky sometimes. So, uh, yeah, I, it, it was showing like 40... I want to say it was 7.2 or, or not 7.2, 0 0.072 earlier, I believe. Um, but I don't know if it ever hit coin market cap like that. So um, let's check out CCX. Down a little bit. This is another one of those little gems, hidden gem type uh, projects there. Look at Bitcoin Diamond. We always look at that one too. 13%. Wow, up way up over a um, dollar again. So that's awesome. Wish I had the other focus. Oh, yeah, I can do the cams here. So that is super cool. Let's look at my head is like peeling. Um, I had to cut my grass, you know, this past weekend for the first time in the, in the new place. And um, the yard's a lot bigger than my old house. And it took me four hours with a push mower. So the next thing I'm going to buy is probably a riding lawnmower because, yeah, that's not good. Um, let's see. We'd have to go to, I don't know what BitCash is doing. We would have to go to CoinGecko, I think, to see that. What? Wow. Wow. Awesome. Oh my gosh. That is incredible. 
Up 92%, guys. Yikes. That's sick. That's sick. And I've been covering this one for a while. I mean, I don't know what the volume is. Let's check it. 10,000. 10, okay. So, um, yeah, all right. So, cool your jets. Settle down. There's only 10,000 volume. <laughs> but still, 92%. Wow. Awesome. That's cool to see. Uh, that was a legitimate, like, oh my gosh, because I, I hadn't checked it. I really hadn't. All right. Uh, what else we got? Bitcash and BTZ, maybe? I don't know. That's not it. That's not what I want to see. Maybe. I think I wrote that down because someone was mentioning it on uh, Twitter or something. They were, I did this tweet a little while back about um, basically like my top 10 and top 10 like mining or holding. Let's see if I can find it real quick. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, here we go. So, yeah, and if you're not following me on Twitter, you should do it because, you know, I talk about the show over there and I also do stupid stuff like this where I'm, I list like my top 10 uh, mining or holding. So I, I put this out, it was like one through nine, and then I said, what should go here? And I've actually got 68 comments. That's quite a lot for me. Um, yes, I have BTC. Uh, and Ethereum. I mean, Ethereum's not on the list either, is it? Nope. Uh, so, yeah, I have both of those. But this was specifically like mining type stuff, right? Uh, mining and holding. Things that I'm mining, but I'm not trading. I'm just holding on to them. Or that I have mined, right? I think uh, the one that oh, we were just looking at, <clears throat> BTZ, was in here somewhere. But yeah, this was a pretty good thread here because there was a lot of really good conversations and stuff going on on this stuff. Cool stuff. <laughs> more XWP, more swap. Yeah, this was a this was a super good thread for me because normally I don't get that kind of engagement. So. Um, Yeah, pretty cool. Um, yeah, there's a lot. I mean, there's a ton of different ones that could go in number 10. I mean, I don't know. I, don't, I haven't really picked one yet, I guess, to drop in here, but uh, maybe I will at some point. But that, that tweet really worked good for engagement, though. Not that I'm really into that, but it, it's nice to see that because I, I typically don't get that, that much. I mean, like here, look at this one, you know, three comments. 16 likes or whatever one re retweet this one got 10 cool stuff yeah so pretty soon I'll be able to move all the rigs into the um, garage it's going probably going to need <laughs> the next thing I'll probably need is some type of cooling because it's going to be so hot in there um, or at least some type of exhaust fan to get the hot air out of there